Today we're going to try a Japanese uh, horse racer. Not each game, I guess I can say that because I don't want to get demoted, that's for sure. So yeah, we are trying something new and hopefully this is going to be interesting. I'm not exactly sure yet. This game is called Tag After School or if I want I can say this in Japanese, which is going to be a bad pronunciation, but let's see at the name. It's called Hokago no Onigoku, I think. And this game is made by Dottoro, a big Shout out to him and I have played this game for a small amount of time, only for 10 minutes. Yeah, I'm not that big of a pervert to be honest. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we are going to start a new game and we are going to see how it actually works. This is a really interesting game and I don't think I need to describe too much because you are going to see it in the intro. Uh, you will know what this game actually is about. So let's begin. Once upon a time, there was a timid Shotakun. So our character is called Shotakun, which is uh, yeah, interesting. Sure. One day his friend said, "Hey Shota, go to close school over there at night." So we are going to go to a. Uh, I don't think this school is in the city. It's probably in uh, forest or something like that. Cause just take a look at the area. There are so many trees in there. <laughs> but why? I can't do voice acting. <laughs> Uh, cause you are a coward, you need to be more brave. I am more like the friend to be honest. I'm kind of like a bully. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Hopefully I'm not going to get demoralized. Uh, but it's too scary, okay? Otherwise I won't play with you. I don't need a coward like you. As a friend. So Shutagon came to the closed school alone late at night. And here he is. Uh, overall the game's concept is quite simple. It's kind of like a uh, vintage... Uh, gaming mechanics uh, you are going to go left or right you can hide and that's pretty much it there is not like a lot of 2020 stuff or something like that it's a pretty basic game and i think it's actually a really cool concept obviously no there is nothing to scare there is nothing to be scared of so i think there has been a little bit uh, mistakes in the translation but i think uh, we can overlook that and again uh, my english is not going to be that good either just grab anything as the evidence and get out of here. So something shiny is in the floor. So you can actually collect some stuff. You can collect keys. You can collect a lot of lot of stuff. Your main aim is to survive in this school for a really long around uh, long period of time. And if you can survive without getting caught, then you can actually leave. Otherwise, you are just going to die. And I'm going to. I can't show you the spicy stuff. That's for sure, but. Uh, I can give you a little bit details when those things are being played at or something like that. Hmm, what's this? Okay, so we have found a pair of panties or maybe one panty. I am not exactly sure because it says uh, in a plural form. Okay, someone is coming. So as you can see, we can hide. I have to actually blot this thing out because I think we can uh, see her who at this moment. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we could see her hoo-ha. Uh, so Shotakun is out. Is she gone? I got... Uh, okay, so here is another character. So there are way too many ghosts. All of them are ghosts, by the way. And all of them wants us. And by us, I mean our Shotakun. Uh, so we need to hide from them. So this uh, ghost is called Hanako. And we are going to talk with her. Wow, who, who are you? <laughs> me? Hanako. Don't you want to play a game with me? If you play tag with my friends by 6 o'clock, I will let you go. Tag, what happens when I get caught? Fufu, do you really want to know? And there it goes. I definitely have to blot this out because otherwise my channel is bye bye. So, yeah. Uh, wow, etc. etc. Anyway, good luck with your play. So, it's 1 am right now and the game starts. So, we have to survive for 5 hours. And if we can survive, then we can get out of this place. Keep pressing Z to interact with objects. If the flashlight is on, it works faster. Pressing Shift makes you run fast, but it can also make you exhausted if you are out of stamina. So we can hide with Z, I guess. So there we go. And I actually want need to see something. What is the option menu though? So there is something in the floor. Let's just see what that is. So it's uh, is that milk? 
Or is that a bottle of water? That could be bottle of water. I have a dirty mind anyway, so <laughs> let's just forget about that. And where else can we go? Let's go there. There is something in the floor again. Uh, by the way, there are a lot of different kinds of ghosts, so you need to survive from all of them. Uh, there is nothing in here. Okay, that makes sense. Overall, the game's uh, what should I say? Graphics looks pretty smooth, to be honest. It's kind of like a typical uh, Japanese school, and we have seen so many enemies. Okay, there is. No, 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 The flashlight is actually really good to be honest. Uh, without the flashlight, we cannot exactly spot them clearly. We can spot some of them, but not all of them. We can hide in there. Uh, let's just hide. My heartbeat was getting really very fast, so there probably was one ghost uh, somewhere nearby. Our battery is draining really fast, so I actually have to turn off my flashlight, otherwise I could have died. There is something in the bucket, let's see what can we find. We need to hide. No, she caught us again. This girl is... This angel is really bad, man. Oh man, she's not letting us sleep. So he lost two life already and to the same ghost. Come on, somebody else check my beacon for fuck's sake. And this is a hard game to be honest. Yes, we know that there is that uh, snow snow thing about this game. But even without the snow snow game uh, thing, uh, I think this is a really cool game. Okay, there is another ghost. By the way, the photo that you can see on my right is actually a ghost. And it's going to be inside that uh, painting all the time. But she can do something inside that painting. So you actually need to be careful about that. I don't want to get close to her because otherwise I'm going to die. And it's actually really annoying. She is probably one of the most annoying one to be honest. There is another ghost that's going to tell us to stop. If we don't stop at her words, then uh, well, she will do stuff with us. And if somebody else comes at the same time, then we are just going to get destroyed. Again, are you fucking kidding me? And there goes our life. So that's going to be game over. The same ghost destroyed ice uh, three times. So yeah, that's it.